Iran's ultimate authority, Supreme Leader Ayatollah Ali Khamenei, in a meeting with the Air Force, responded to comments made by U.S. President Donald Trump on Twitter. This man who has come into the White House says Iran must be thankful to Obama. Why? Because of ISIL and spreading fire in Iraq and Syria and supporting the unrest after the presidential elections of 2009? He was the one who brought crippling sanctions on the Iranian nation but couldn't achieve anything with them. The Supreme Leader went on to say that the Iranian people will show their response to what he sees as threats made against them by the United States in the upcoming 38th anniversary of the Islamic Revolution on Friday. No enemy can paralyze the Iranian nation. President Hassan Rouhani responded to President Trump's Twitter comments in which he described the nuclear agreement of 2015 as the, quote, worst ever negotiated. The new U.S. president reads the nuclear deal but cannot even tolerate it. He says this is the worst deal in history. This is a win-win agreement. Everybody benefits from it. The nuclear negotiations can be used as an example for other talks to bring stability and security to the region. And thanks to the deal, Iran's nuclear program continues to advance. The head of Iran's atomic energy organization says Iran has received the final batch of a shipment of 149 tons of natural uranium from Russia. This shipment means Iran has now imported 359 tons of yellow cake or natural uranium since the signing of the 2015 nuclear agreement, increasing its stockpile by 60%. The agreement allows Iran to sell its enriched uranium and buy yellow cake, which is mainly used to fuel nuclear reactors in return. While the Supreme Leader did not mention this agreement in his speech, he has expressed his opinion on the matter in the past, and that is that Iran did not get everything it should have. But for now, the officials here maintain the position that despite its shortcomings, this deal is better than no deal at all. Dorsa Jabari, Al Jazeera, Tehran.